walking the dog. How y'all doing today? Hope this finds you well. Beautiful day here today. You know the argument keep coming. Defense of the face. I have to say things. You know, this country's going to hell, you know. No longer a free country. We have a government that thinks it can enslave you, force you to work without compensation. That's what slavery is, forced work without compensation. You know these people out there, well the unbelievers, boy, they're a funny bunch. Yeah. Your God's an evil God. They bring up the issue of slavery and stoning gay people and things like that and all that nonsense. As an argument, there's no God. All the evil in the world, there's no God. That, that's a that's a non sequitur, people. It's a non sequitur. Look it up. Even if God is evil, doesn't doesn't change whether there's a God or not. And uh, the argument of good and evil thing, it that really it gets to you after a while. The ignorance in people. You know, uh, reminds me of the story of Joseph from the Bible. Brothers meant evil for him when they bound him and sold him as a slave. Got to Egypt and he was treated even worse. Ended up in prison looking at death. But see, God use, uses these things trials in our lives, these troubles, for a greater good. And because Joseph was in the right place at the right time with the right gift God gave him, he was able to not only save the Egyptians from starvation and famine, in the famine coming, he was able to save his own people and reunite the family and forgive those brothers that did that to him. How many of you would forgive your brothers that did something like that to you? You see, he glorified God, not the Pharaoh, for these things. This gift came from God. And the evil that was done to him, though it was done by men, was turned by God into something great. Are you letting the bad things in your life turn you from God? Or are you taking these bad things in life and looking how God can change them? Keeping your faith in God so that He can change them. Circumstances for the good. You ask the wrong questions. Most of your arguments are non sequitur. So, I'm going to stop on that one. I'm not going to let it destroy the peace. Me and my dog walking. Beautiful day that God has made. I will glorify Him and me and my family. We'll glorify Him this day.